Hi you guys, welcome to another video. My name is Rochelle and this is Beyond Envelopes. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. As you can see, we have our big binder right here today. So that means we're gonna be doing our savings challenges for the third week of April. Um, I've been pretty off with the filming of the videos because I've just been going through a lot as far as like getting my requirements um, done for my two jobs that I'm starting. So I've just been back and forth doing a lot of um, testing, uh, physicals, getting paperwork, all that stuff. So yeah, so let's go ahead and get started. I am... If you guys missed my last video, I, I did condense my envelopes and binder. So we are actually going to start with that today too, instead of doing the challenges right away. So I just kept the money over here. So this was our leftover money from last week, and as well as the money that was left over in our um, cash envelopes. So this was the money left over from the cash envelopes. It was 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. And let's just go ahead and get this um, settled. So this is my once and five savings challenge and we're just gonna simply just open it and stick the money in there. And this is all done. So as far as this, this is the money that was left over in my um, from my cash stuffing. So it is 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 31, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So 139, but we're actually also gonna be condensing my um, savings challenge envelopes. Um, so month monthly savings, this is my 52 week savings we're gonna keep. My save your age we're gonna keep. Um, this 20K at 18, I think I'm gonna change it to 18K at 18. I just thought that maybe that's a little <laughs> better. Um, but I don't technically have to stuff this until um, August because that's my, daughter's um, that's my daughter's birthday month. So from August 2023 to August, what year is she gonna turn 18? Um, 2031 i think yeah i believe so wow 2031 that's insane um so she's 11 now and i wanted to get this done by the time she's 18 so it's gonna take seven years to do this challenge and each um stack of money is 500 i might start this before or i'm not sure depending on how my budgeting is gonna go um i'll either start this before august or by august so that's going to stay house opoly we're actually going to take out for now um so the house opoly and this um scratchers we're gonna go to my um house sinking fund so i think we're just gonna keep one of them for now and i really want to finish the um scratch offs so we're all, we're just gonna do that um this house off houseopoly hasn't been doable for me because these have high amounts so we're gonna go ahead and take this out um but we are gonna actually so for houseopoly we had 1500 six seven hundred twenty forty five so the 1500 i'm actually gonna move into my house um sinking fund so and then this we're gonna add into our stuffing for today so let me just grab the binder all right so here is the binder with my house um sinking fund so i think it's yeah so this is the home sinking fund so i'm gonna add the 1500 i also technically really have 10,000 an additional 10,000 saved that I saved in 2022 when I was away from YouTube. So I might just grab another placeholder and like put 10K here, we'll see. Um, but for now, we'll just move the 1,500 here. So really in home, I have 11,500. 
all right so we're just gonna put this aside for now once i finish this um scratch offs we'll go back to doing this it is just because i have a pretty low budget right now and if you missed my last video i did mention that i want to start um front loading my 401k um, if you guys don't know i am a travel nurse and i started traveling last year and so i wasn't able to contribute to a 401k for a whole year until now um so that's that and the only other thing we're gonna remove is the reward savings challenge i really wanted to do this to see how much i save at the end of the year but mainly to see if um i can cover my annual fee with the rewards um so i use two cards mainly it's the quicksilver capital one quicksilver and the american express um blue cash card only the american express has a um, annual fee of 95 dollars and so if you guys can see i already saved here 30 60 and 75 so that's way above 95 dollars i did want to see how much i'm able to save for the whole year but i can just do that um with my spreadsheet tracker that i have on my computer and on my phone um so yeah because we are currently lower on the budget i think i'm just gonna um take this out and instead of stuffing the rewards money here we'll just add it on to our savings challenges stuffing um so we're gonna take out the money and in here we currently have 50 100 20 40 65 so 165 and i believe that's it we're gonna keep everything else um so let's go ahead and see how much we're gonna stuff now so all right so now we are gonna stuff um 100 250 300 20 40 60 80 400 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 95 500 uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 41, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So $549 is now what we're going to be stuffing in today's savings challenges. Um, I'm not sure if I have the right denominations to do the challenges today, but we'll just see how it goes. Maybe hopefully we can get some change in some of the envelopes. Um so let me just put this away okay you guys so let me just move these so we can make a little more space all right so let's go ahead and start with my 52 week savings challenge i normally start with my 100 envelopes but because i haven't been doing that like i used to do um we could just go ahead and wait and see what we have left over and then we'll stuff it all right so my 52 week savings challenges instead of stuffing one through 52 i stuff the um the date of my paychecks which is usually on fridays um i haven't had a paycheck in like three weeks now um so technically this would have been from april 14th so we're just gonna um stuff 14 dollars so we'll cross off the 14 and then let's add 10 let's see if i have a dollar so i'm gonna grab a dollar and then we'll just add 15 so all right so that is that for this i don't count these normally i usually count them when i do my um bill swap or cash condensing videos all right so that challenge is all done next is our save your age so i save my age every week i am 32 years old so we're let's go ahead and cross off a 32 dollar bag so 32 and then let's go ahead and add 20 30 and two dollars so 20 30 one and two all right and this challenge is all done 
um, this should be finished before my birthday, which is in December. So we've got plenty of time. I'm not used to this big binder. I feel like I'm like fumbling everywhere with this. All right. This, I, like I said, I might start before August or by August. So we're not going to do it right now. Okay, so let's go ahead and do the scratcher. We haven't done a scratch for a while now. I actually do have two of them. I am going to wait to do this also once this is done. Actually, I'm like contemplating to see which one I should do first. But since I already started this, I kind of do want to just start with this and then do this after. So we're probably just, let's just put this away for now. And then let's go ahead and go for the biggest denomination card so I think it was this one because this is what we started with um yeah so this does have the most it has 75 to 150 all right so let's go ahead and scratch one from here uh where do I want to go so let's see let's go ahead and scratch this one okay so we have another 130 and i'll finish scratching the rest um at the end of the video so let's go ahead and add 100 120 and 130. i'm really curious to see how much this adds up to because um this is from she has cash and plans here on youtube i told her that i didn't want to know how much the total was so i really have no clue how much it's gonna end up so all right so this challenge is all done next we're gonna do actually let's skip and go to um ha uh, the holidays first um so this is basically for um this is for mother's day halloween and Christmas, I already finished the Thanksgiving one. So we're actually going to finish all of these savings challenges today. So for um, Mother's Day, we're going to add $40. All right, so we don't have much 20s. So let's see, I'm just going to grab a 10 and put a 50 in here. So this challenge is all done. So this should be 200. So we have 150, 70, 90, $200 um, for Mother's Day. Halloween, we have left over three candles. They're $2 each. So that's two, four, six. And then we have one letter and a letter is um, a dollar. So we have $7 left for this savings challenge. So let's go ahead and color that. Okay, so let's go ahead and add seven dollars. So I have five and two singles. Okay, so let's see how much we have in Halloween. We have 50, 70, 5, 80, 5, uh, 6, 7, 8, 9, 90, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 100 dollars in Halloween. And then next is Christmas. So we have 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, $14. So let's go ahead and color all of these. Okay, so now everything is colored in. So let's go ahead and add $14. Once again, I'll grab a dollar and then just add 15. So 10 and a five. And then now for Christmas, it is 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 100. And these were basically for like um, the Christmas potluck that we usually do with me and my friends. So now all these three challenges are all done. So all of these challenges are going to go into one um, envelope now. If you missed my last video, like I said, I condensed my envelope. So holidays and special occasions are going to be in one envelope. So we're gonna all add this to that one envelope. So let's see. So yay, we finished three more challenges. All right, so let's put this away because these are all done. 
So now we're going to add this into my holidays and occasions. So we have 150, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90. 91, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 400. So $400 is going to be going into my um, holidays and special occasions. I'm not sure where I put that. I think it's in this one. And I haven't created new labels yet, so I still have the old labels that are on here. Um, so... Okay, so holidays is the envelope. This should this is going to be holidays and special occasions. So let's add all of this together. All right, so holidays and occasions, we now have 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 50, 600, 50, 70, 90, 710, 730, 50, 70, 90, 800. Wow, 800? 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 90. So 6, no, 890, if I counted that correctly. I think so. Oh my gosh, that's a lot of money. Um, so the next holiday will be uh, Mother's Day. And then after that is, um, I think, my brother's birthday in June. So, wow, we had a good amount. But I am going to be needing a lot of money for my daughter's birthday. That's on, in August. She wants to do, like, a water park or maybe, like, I was thinking of doing, like, a spa bus for her and her friends. So, we'll just see what we end up doing. But, wow, yeah, that's a lot of money now. Okay, great. So this is completely empty. So let's go ahead and put this away. I am going to be doing a... Actually, we're going to leave it here. And I am actually going to be doing a um, Christmas um, savings challenge for the gifts specifically. I already have some money saved for that. So I'm thinking of saving either 1000 or 1300 um, because I also usually send money to the Philippines um, for Christmas. So I will be creating a tracker. Um, I just haven't decided yet if I want to save 1000 or 1300 uh, Usually I send 300 back home. So I don't know yet, but I'll decide um, by next week. So that's done. Next up... We have been neglecting this summer savings challenge. Um, each icon is twenty dollars. So okay, so we only we've only done two of the icons for summer savings challenge. Mm, do I want to do this now? Um, I think let's go back to this one. Drop the pounds. I haven't. I didn't even get to weigh myself this morning or last Wednesday when I usually supposed to do this. I am thinking about just doing the weigh in once a month, um, just because weekly usually fluctuates. What do you guys think about that? Um, but I probably gained weight because last weekend, um, me and my friends and my daughter we went to a philippine festival so it was basically like different food vendors and also like clothing and some other items um so yeah i did a little bit of eating last weekend um so this is gonna be skipped today let's go ahead and these do these challenges i think so of course let's start with shut the box and i'm actually gonna see if i could finish this today so Let's go ahead and put away this big binder for now. All right, so let's grab some markers. I don't think I have the same colors, but that's okay. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and do this one. So I have a 10. Oops, so let's go ahead and color nine and one. All right, next. We have eight. So let's go ahead and color eight. Next we have two. 
and then we have 12 so let's see which one we can do seven and five all right let's keep going i have four wow this is going pretty well i think <laughs> the last game i did was terrible all right next i have five which i can't do so that means we have to save six and three so that's nine dollars all right so i'm gonna grab a dollar and put ten dollars all right let's keep going i have eight five um at 10 so let's do nine and one again um i have six um 10 so let's do seven and three next we have oh my gosh i shut the box again are you serious oh my gosh i have four and two and that's what we have left wow that is insane oh my gosh you guys i shut the box again that's twice in one game i did shut the box the first time and now i shut the box again oh my gosh that's crazy this this game is so exciting you guys don't even know i it's either you're get, you're gonna go really bad where you need to add a lot of money or you're doing great so <laughs> let's go ahead and keep going we're gonna finish this game today so we have two and one. Oh boy so that's three yeah i almost lost the dice so Let's just go ahead and re-roll. <laughs> All right, so I have nine, 10. So let's do eight and two. Next we have six, seven, oopsie, eight. So can't do that. So we now have to save five, four, and one. So that's $10. So $10. So let's go ahead and grab a 10 and add a 20. And then let's do the last game. So let's go ahead. So I have six and a one. So that's seven. I have six. Next. 12 so we can do 9 and 3 7 so we could do 5 and 2 i'm not sure if you guys can hear my daughter but she's in the living room singing her heart away so <laughs> you guys can hear that all right let's keep going i have 10 so we can't do that so we have to save 8 4 and 1 so that is 13 all right so let's add 10 11 12 and 13 so 10 11 12 and 13 so this challenge is also done let's go ahead and count how much we saved i can't believe i shut the box twice you guys twice all right so we have 20 40 60 70 80 90 95 100 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so we have 108 that we saved and shut the box. All right, so this I haven't actually decided where I'm going to put it, but I think we're going to go ahead and add it onto clothing. Um, if you guys have been watching my weekly check-ins, um, you would know that I that we have been shopping for clothes for my daughter, but we do still need like sandals for the summer. So I think that's, that would be a good idea to just add that on there so say goodbye to shut the box i don't know if i'm gonna do this again i will see i definitely want to because it's so fun but like i said with the low budget i'm not sure so i'll decide by next week if i'm gonna redo this so let's go ahead and find my clothing 
envelope. All right, so okay, it's back here. So we're just gonna add a ten dollar to it. I'm not gonna recount. I forgot already how much I said it was. <laughs> so all right, so that is done. Let's grab our big binder again. So let's see what else we can do here. Um, let's go ahead and play these other games, I think. How much do I need for this? So actually, let's go ahead and do back to school. I'm going to do two of the backpacks. They're both $50 each. So we'll add 100 And I'll just add the 100 right here. Oops. All right, so let's go ahead and color the two backpacks. Okay, so this is all done. Okay. So now let's go ahead and do these two um, savings challenges. Let's put this big binder away again. All right, so let's first start with um, Savings Land. So the last time we played this game, which was a while ago, we ended up in this box right here. So let's go ahead and roll for the amount. So I have six, so I have one, two, three, four, five, and six. So $34, and let's go ahead and Put a line through that and add 34. So 20, 30, 1, 2, 3, and 4. And let's add this on. We have a lot of singles here. I'm actually going to take five singles and change it to a $5 bill. So 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And just change that just so we can have some more change to work with and this challenge is all done and then next we're gonna go with the roll the dice with a twist last time we played this we ended up in the piggy bank i always forget which direction we go so i started here so we're going now we're going this way so let's roll the blue die for this oh no actually we ended up in the 13 i didn't see that i colored it purple so let's see let's roll first so i have a six again so let's see so we're going this way so one two three four five and six so we're gonna save sixteen dollars we have a lot of singles here too so i'm gonna add hmm Okay, let's first add the 16 so I don't get confused. So 10, 5, and a $1 bill. And then... Now let's go ahead and grab five singles. So 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. And switch that for a $5 bill. Alright, so this challenge is all done. Oops, I thought I mixed the money up. Oh my gosh. Okay. All right. Sorry I'm from all over the place in this table. It's kind of messy today, but oh well. All right, so let's put this away. I still really, I should really paper clip this. All right, so next. Let's go ahead and do the summer savings challenge since we've been neglecting this one. Um, let's go and add, um, let's see what we have left over. 50, 20. Okay, let's just go ahead and count this. So I have 50, 20, 70, 80, 90, 100, 5, 
10, 15, 20, 21, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, oh, 30. So 130 is what we have left. Mm, what do I want to do? So, this is all done. This is done. We're not starting this yet. This is done. This is done. So really, the only thing we have left is this challenge and my 100 envelope challenge. So let's go ahead and add $40 to this one. All right, so 20, 30, 40. All right, and then we're just going to color two of the icons. So, all right, so let's go ahead and color. Hmm. All right, so that challenge is all done. Now, the rest of the money is going to go into my 100 envelope challenge. And this is the box that I use. So, I have 50... Let's do a $50 um, envelope and then we 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 31, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40. So we'll do a $50 one um, and two 20s. So, all right. Okay, so let's go ahead and find. So I have 48 here, which will get a $50 bill. All right, let's see what else. So let's go ahead and cross off 48. All right, and then I said 20. So that means we have to get like one from the teens number. All right, let's go ahead and do 17. And if you guys don't know, I do this challenge differently also. So 0 to 5 gets 5, 6 to 10 gets 10, 11 to 20 gets 20, 21 to 50 gets 50, and 51 to 100 gets 100. So I have, I said, 17. So this will get a 20. So 17. Actually, we're going to do two tens because I don't like being uneven um, with my envelopes. Um, so each each week I used to pull two envelopes. So instead of three envelopes, we'll do two of the $10 ones. So we'll do 10 and 6. So we'll do cross off 6 and 10. And now we only have three left of the lower amounts. So that got a 10 and then this will get all this 10 singles so one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten all right and then these finished envelopes will just go in the back facing the other way all right so we still have a pretty good amount of envelopes left we have a lot in the hundreds and fifty dollar range so hopefully we get to stuff those um and yeah so this challenge is all done all right you guys we are all out of money so that means this saving challenge video is all done i'm so glad to have finished four challenges so we finished all four of these challenges wow that's great so that's four less challenges i have to worry about i'm really trying to stretch out my budget and be able to stuff um most of my envelopes i was stressing out about like not being able to stuff all the savings challenges even though i don't have to stress i know i don't i shouldn't stress about it but i don't know i just couldn't help it so yeah, so that is it this for this video, you guys. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing if you haven't already. Um, I'm sorry it was a little bit messy and all over the place, but I'll try to do better than next week. Um, so yeah, 
and I hope you guys stick around. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.